Hi, I am Bernhard Zoom, Product Marketer at Elastic, and I want to help customers like you successfully apply machine learning. And today my focus is on a process known as root cause analysis. Why would you be interested in root cause analysis? Well, because it's essential to prevent complex system issues from recurring, saving you operational costs and your customers bad experiences. For example, if you are a site reliability engineer responsible for an e-commerce site and ensuring good customer experiences, what if you receive an alert that something is wrong with the checkout process and customers are having trouble? What are you going to do next? Maybe you are able to reproduce the problem like shown here. After selecting the vintage camera, it takes a long time to add it to the cart. While it does eventually succeed, like now, you need to get to what's the underlying root cause and causing that latency. And this is where root cause analysis comes into play. Root cause analysis typically proceeds in four phases. First, define the problem and detect it in your data. Two, analyze the data, drill deeper to get to possible causal factors. Three, determine the actual root cause, looking at all the factors and suggest corrective action, which then in phase four, you go to implement to prevent recurrence in the future. While the process is intuitive, it is difficult to perform. Therefore, watch the whole series to learn more about approaches in part one, apply it in observability with the IOPS in part two, how to apply to security in part three, and smart monitoring in manufacturing part four. See you in the next video.